The Arctic tundra biome is found in the northern hemisphere above the Arctic Circle around the northern areas of Alaska in the countries of Canada, Russia, Norway, Iceland, and Greenland. The Arctic tundra is known as the coldest biome in the world. There are two main seasons, winter and summer. The winter season is extremely cold with the average temperatures of negative 34 degrees Celsius. It is known for its cold, desert-like conditions. There is limited sunlight in the region in the winter. At times, the sun can remain below the horizon for up to two months. Because it is so cold, there is low biotic diversity in the region. The summer growth and reproduction season is short. It lasts for only 50 to 60 days. In the summer, the sun shines 24 hours a day. Because of the constant sunlight, the tundra biome is able to sustain life. The average temperature in the summer ranges from 3 to 12 degrees Celsius. Including melting snow, there is only 6 to 10 inches of precipitation per year. There are 1,700 different kinds of plants found in the Arctic tundra. There is low vegetation throughout the biome. The permafrost layer restricts plants with long roots to grow into the soil. Short root plants like low shrubs, mosses, lichen, and grasses are found in the tundra. Even though there is low light and low temperatures, plants in the Arctic tundra can still carry out photosynthesis. The animals in the tundra are adapted to handle the long, cold winters and breed and raise their young quickly in the summer. There are very few species that live in the Arctic tundra. Caribou, lemmings, Arctic heron squirrels, Arctic foxes, wolves, polar bears, and birds like ravens, falcons, snowbirds, and different species of gulls are some of the animals found in the tundra. Just like many other birds, the birds found in the Arctic tundra migrate south during the winter. Because there are rivers in the tundra, fish like cod, salmon, trout, and flatfish are able to live there. Global warming is a threat to the Arctic tundra because during the summer months, the plants grow quickly, absorbing the carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, but because the summer season is so short, the organic matter freezes into the permafrost before it has time to... Oil spills are becoming more common in the tundra because oil has been found underneath the soil. Oil companies run the risk of harming animals and the environment when they drill for the oil. Air pollution is also considered a threat to the tundra with growing amounts of DDT and PCB rising every year. If oil companies do not take precaution during drilling expeditions, they could permanently damage the ecosystem of the Arctic tundra.